Well, uh, the judgment in the tribunal on uh, government and the tribunal Peter Obi. The case is beyond Peter Obi, rather part of a new Nigeria, Azan Labo. A retired Colonel Azan Labo, a veteran of the Nigerian Army's Allied Infantry Special Forces Corps, has shared his extensive professional experience and interview with Sun 31 years and participated in combat uh, duty tour, including Liberia, Sierra Leone, West Defoe, and the Bakasi Peninsula. I got invited by some well respected uh, senior colleagues uh, who felt my service was needed in strengthening the security threshold during the Labour Party's presidential nationwide campaign. So, this is what I saw as a call to duty. And we made a tremendous success of the opportunity. For the next plan of the Labour Party, it is to await the outcome of the court and take it on from there. The leadership of the party will uh, direct accordingly what specific steps and in what direction to go. Nigerians are also observing a graveyard silence across the country with an eye on the judiciary, though no one is asking to be favoured. But Nigerians urge uh, the judiciary to do uh, the simple right thing. Uh, now, the case beyond the Peter will be rather the birth of a new Nigeria. A Nigeria where the son of a nobody can become somebody without uh, knowing anybody. Yes. According to Stan Labo, uh, the 2023 general elections in Nigeria were the worst in the nation's uh, history. He expressed his concerns uh, about the election process and highlighted the need of uh, need, need for improvement in addition uh, the mentioned uh, he mentioned that he was invited by senior colleagues to join the labor party a uh, presidential nationwide campaign so as part of efforts to strengthen the country's uh, security uh, viewing this uh, invitation as a call to duty he and his team achieved a significant success uh, during the campaign now, the sources of the opportunity uh, for the next plan of the Labour Party it is to await the outcome of the court and take it on from there. The leadership of the party will direct accordingly what uh, specific steps and in what uh, directions go. Uh, Nigerians uh, are also observing the graveyard uh, silence across the country with an eye on the judiciary, uh, though no one is asking to be favoured. But Nigerians urge the judiciary to do the same uh, and do the simple right thing. Uh, the case is beyond Peter Obi, uh, rather the rebirth of a new Nigeria, a Nigeria where the son of a nobody can become somebody without uh, knowing anybody. As a quote, and is a line uh, to follow. You know, according to Stan uh, Labo, uh, he said uh, he got invited by some well-respected uh, senior colleagues uh, who felt my service was needed in strengthening the security threshold during the Labour Party presidential nationwide campaign tour. That's what it says. And it has been quoted once again as far uh, for the next plan. According to the plan, I said I was observing a graveyard. Yeah, everybody is watching. Uh, even people in diaspora are watching and just in diaspora. Uh, the foreign countries are watching. Uh, the developed countries they are watching. You know, people that are not even citizens of Nigeria are watching. Now, since they can only watch and there is no monitoring and that, that was why the uh, you know foreign or international observers came they came in they don't want to disturb they can't disturb they just came to observe and it is now uh, on the verge of gunpowder i mean uh, the nigerian politics and the tinubu uh, administration as far you know winning the election and uh, how the election was won uh, it was true true rigging, uh, rigging rather sorry according to Peter Obi and um, um, Atiku Abubakar because they were the contending contenders contending a president or presidential candidate of other parties like the PDP of uh, Atiku and the Labour Party of uh, L, uh, OB. So since they are in the tri tribunal, Tinubu needs to face, you know, uh, face the panel, you know, either, okay, I will believe uh, now. Atiku and uh, OB, they are the, uh, the plaintiff. Then the defendant or defender is the Tinumbu, uh, Ashiwa Jubala Men Tinumbu. Uh, well, uh, regarding future plans, Stan Labo stated that the Labour Party is currently awaiting the outcome of uh, court proceedings and will determine the next steps accordingly. The party's uh, leadership also will provide specific directions 
On the course of action, he emphasized that Nigerians are closely observing the current state of the country, particularly the silence that prevalent nationwide with a focus on the judiciary while not seeking uh, preferential treatment. Nigerians are urging the judiciary to uphold justice and fairness. Stan Lambo believes that the cases goes beyond Peter Obi, also emphasizing the importance of a new Nigeria that allows individuals to rise to prominence based on their merit rather than connections or status. Now, straight to the comment, uh, um, the time is far spent and uh, let's hear what people you know, have to say and have uh, over. Yeah, personally, I'm not uh, voting against the real winner case that's come from a guest. As someone says, uh, me too. I was so enthusiastic to vote the candidate same to be the hope of the nation. In the narrative of bad government or governance in Nigeria, low and behold, my enthusiasm was to drag uh, anybody to the floor. I vowed to vote again until the presidency is returned to the one world is on their merit. Now, the majority of Nigerians uh, or Nigeria electorate seem not to be understood and not to also understand that Obi represents a new Nigeria. His government is to give uh, room for fairness and equality. And since everyone has a competitive advantage in a particular area of life, Obi's government was supposedly uh, to see you excel in that area. That is what it is. And I wonder why uh, people are not seeing the battle uh, between the old order and the new order. Uh, between how we have always done it and the new, between those uh, who classify themselves by their wealth and the new uh, and the new also between those who suffocate the poor and the new well uh, according to this person uh, well uh, i believe uh, is on the verge of uh, you know conclusion as far you know democracy and politics and policy and system of governance and that is what it is and then if majority of nigerian electorate uh, seem not to understand that will be represented in nigeria and uh, that is uh, left for them but everybody is entitled to opinion well finally according to coleman the reply says, the whole world knows that election was mad. Uh, that is a M-A-R-E-D was mad. Uh, M-A-R-E-D. Uh, what that simply means is that the election of 2023, February uh, 25, was uh, rigged. That is what uh, is being written Daddy. here and that is what uh, we believe is what it is. Now, Tinumbu, Tinumbu, Igbos, Igbos. Uh, I don't know where all these uh, judgment is coming from so many people have submission then as far as a submission does not water it is no submission and that's no result uh, according to retired colonel labo uh, he said rather uh, the case is beyond peter will be uh, rather the rebirth of a new nigeria definitely well this one i'm going to draw the curtain i like to share views in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe also click on the bell icon to get more notification thanks for listening and god bless you That's what I'm going to do with PPL. Why I'm going to do with PPL. Why I'm going to do with PPL.